a certain amount of time, I think, and then he has to go to another town and do the same thing, and another town and the same thing, and then one more town, and it's over, and th- when he only has, like, 30 in-game days to do it. And so, like, he'll name his... And, like, so he does random traits, so, like, you can get really bad... Like, you can literally be, like, um, like books help you um, get XP in the game. So, like, there's literally a trait that can make you illiterate, so you literally can't read books in order to, like, help you, uh, get, uh, skills and shit. Anyways, so, he, he'll name each character somebody in chat, uh, like, uh-huh. randomly. Um, and I had been watching for, like, I, it had been, like, a few days in that I have been watching him, like, randomly. And so he noticed, like, he, since he had seen my name regularly, he's like, you know what, Mr. Kiwi? He's like, I'm gonna make this one after you. And, uh, literally, like, it was looking pretty grim in the, in the beginning. I was like, oh man, like, I'm just gonna, it's gonna be super short. But my man's has been going for days now on my, on my character. Or it's like, literally, this is like the longest I've seen on one character. Dude, nice. <laughs> yeah, and it's fucking Pog. And, like, since it's, since it's my character, he, like, gives me, like, options. Like, if I, like, over what the character, like, looks like and just, like, different shit like that. Like, literally, so I used to have like a bald spot, and it just grew out. Uh, it, it grew out to like this little like rat's nest um, haircut, and he's like, he saw me in chat just now. He's like, oh, he's like, perfect time, Mr. Q. He's like, uh, just the guy I wanted to see. He's like, what what hairstyle do you want? Me? <laughs> <laughs> and I'm just like, hell yeah. I'm just like, yeah I'm just and that's like, it's like a roguelike, so it's like per run. Yeah. Oh, because he sick. does random traits, uh, every character. So my character was obese, feeble, um, but then, like, I think he had really good carpentry, um, uh, just, like, some other shit. Um, but now I'm no longer obese, because, uh, he's, he's made me, uh, since, since it's been so long, he's been in the game that I've, he's lost a bunch of weight. Um, mm, yeah. I don't know. That's sick. You'll have to hear. Link me the stream. I'll check it out after this run. I'm actually getting in really good RNG this run. So far. Okay, what's the button for full screen? I thought it was F11. Yeah. Oh, it is. What the fuck? Why was it not working? in chat. That's a fact.
Bro, my man says old here in chat. He says, first he roleplayed in WoW for four years. Now he was a WoW guild leader for ten years. My man is at least in his forties. <laughs> Guaranteed. Guaranteed. This dude it's old here in chat. It's there's so many like that's what a lot of like the WoW community is like still alive right now is just middle aged men. Playing it. Oh, absolutely. Because like they just they played it as a kid or like when they were eighteen or early twenties or whatever, and so like they just the nostalgia and shit. Yeah, it's not like the new thing to get into for Gen Zs. Yeah. It's, it's, it sucks because, like, sometimes I'll, like, randomly think about, like, playing it, but then, like, literally, like, YouTubers that have, like, been dedicated to WoW for years are literally, like, leaving the game now. Like, not, not because of, like, the recent accusations of Blizzard oh, and yeah. shit, but, like, just because, like, the game is just so pay-to-win now. Like, literally... So like in um in retail wow is what it's called. So it's like wow and shit. Um they added like character boosts. So it's like you can go from level 1 to um like basically to max level basically uh for like 60 bucks or something. Or maybe it's cheaper. Um it's like 40 or 60 bucks. I think it is 60. Uh there's like mounts you can buy off the shit, off the store and shit, which like I guess don't really, those don't really matter as much. But it's more like the character boost. So all that shit is like people didn't really like in retail WoW, and so when Classic WoW came out, they were like, so that's older, uh, like mm -hmm. vanilla WoW. Um, they were like, okay, yeah, you know, we're not gonna do any of the the character boosts or blah blah blah, anything like that, or like faction with the uh, changes so they can literally like you can just pay for extra shit they're like no no that's gonna be in classic and then like literally n not even that long ago they fucking added all that shit <laughs> scumbags <laughs> like, yeah like it's so sad literally like somebody found the file like for the character boost inside of like something before it came out and they like they publicly uh, like called a, called Blizzard out. They're like, 
they're like, are you gonna, they're like, we found this file, does this mean that character boosts are coming to classic? And they uh -huh. literally just didn't respond. Of course. And then, and then just put it out. <laughs> <laughs> So that's why a lot of people are leaving. Uh, just like, like greedy blizzard men. I'm not surprised. <laughs> that's like, bro, it has to be an amazing ass game for me to one, dedicate tons of my time to playing it, and then two, I'm also paying $15 a month to play like i mean obviously you can get you can pay for like a full year and i think it will bring it down to like 12 dollars a month but that's still 12 dollars a month to play a game yeah so like worth. that doesn't to play one or you can buy a whole bunch of other games and you can play it fucking infinitely yeah exactly I don't know why, I was honestly thinking about um, playing Border Borderlands 2 all the way through. Oh, that's not- I'm down to join you. I have Borderlands 3. You wanna try that out together? Oh, I have Borderlands 3. I know. Which one do you have? I have Borderlands 2. <laughs> you wanna get 3? <laughs> I don't know what's going on. I guess some fucking person, some mod from another person's chat joined. And did this open a whole can of worms, bro? Now he's like talking about friendships. And, <laughs> like, because I guess the it, it, it's another streamer that I guess he used to be friends with, and then like the friend pulled some scummy shit or something, or I don't know, something happened, so they're not friends anymore. Um, but the mod is actually being like nice. He thought that the mod was gonna be like taking obviously the streamer that they're modding for his side and shit and be like, you're a piece of shit, but uh blah blah blah. blah. Yeah, but now he's just like ranting about <laughs> fucking friendships and now I don't even know. Gaslighter professional manipulator. <laughs>
kind of crazy how fucked up we are as humans. <laughs> how we've evolved. That's <laughs> what this, this man's talking about. River otters in Japan that, like, they take from, like, Indonesia or just different places. It's like, obviously the living conditions in Japan aren't even anything close to what they need to survive, so it's like... They're just used as basically props to just like fucking take pictures or sell sell to tourist attractions, I guess, or something. I don't know. Mm -hmm. Just goes in a cage all day. <laughs> Who is this? Or just all these otters? Yeah. Jeez. But it's just like, that's just like, uh. <laughs> where I do it, like, uh... Oh no, we, we do crazy shit just for like our own pleasure. Just for profit, baby. Capitalism, baby, it's everywhere.
Got a guy from Bulgaria in chat. It's fucking 9 a.m. over there, apparently. <laughs> wow. It's crazy. Fucking Bulgarian kid is just chilling in his room, watching the same stream I am. <laughs> This this high got you uh got you feeling different tonight.
Alright, bro. I'm pretty tired now. Alright, man. Go to bed. You have a great night, my friend. You too. Good night. Good night, brother.